the most exciting thing ever. Isn't it beautiful? Amazing. This is inside. I have no idea. Wow. So, I guess here's the quartz oven. <laughs> Not yet. Everything is wired by hand. Woohoo! It's ticking! Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. Today I want to show you this. This is probably the most exciting thing ever sitting on my bench. As you might know, Rode und Schwarz built the very first commercially available quartz clock, crystal clock. This is not the first of the world, but it is uh, probably the second one or something like that. Here we have a quartz clock. Isn't it beautiful? Wow. This is just amazing. This unit is sold. It will be shipped to Switzerland today. And this is the last opportunity for me to make a short video. It has all kind of different fixed frequency outputs. They are very precise. Here's a control switch. The result can be seen here. And this is inside. It is just beautiful. Wow. As said before, I don't have too much time, so I have to make this video short. Here's the power supply. We have some large capacitors, loading caps, rectifiers, selenium. Here's the clock. The mechanic part. Unknown resistors. And this is the large oven assembly. I have no idea what's underneath. Wow! <laughs> this is a nicely machined part. Clearly this is brass. You can hear it. Wow, in a very nice chrome finish. Nice. So I guess here is the quartz oven. Hmm. Wait a second. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know exactly. So, I guess here's the quartz oven. Whoa. This is amazing. I don't have time. I'm sorry. This is beautiful. I mean, look at that. What's this type of sandwich construction? Wow. So, I guess here's the quartz oven. <laughs> this is crazy. I mean, whoa. Look at that. One, two, three. <laughs> oh. 
So, you should see the quartz now. Uh, not yet. This is unbelievable. I have never seen something like this in my whole life. This is crazy. So, hmm, can I pull it out? Do I have to screw it? I have no idea. I don't want. I don't want to destroy it. Hmm. How to access this? <gasps> wow! Look at this quartz. This is a large crystal. Wow, this is so beautiful. Quartz Keramik QK. I can't show you more details because this is a fixed unit. I can't take it apart. Yeah, this is amazing. Wow, look at that. So here is a switch. Hmm. I don't get it. Now that's an oven assembly. That's exciting. Do you want me to have a look inside? Okay, let's do it. Wow. <laughs> Here's the oven assembly. Ah, it's a serious business. Amazing. Everything is wired by hand, of course. Here is a large choke for the anode voltage. Large loading caps. Beautiful wire harness. The best parts available. These are Siemens Sikotrop capacitors. They have an amazing Q factor and they are fully sealed, so they are still as new. Date code says July 1955. Awesome. This is probably for the adjustment. And there's a gear. And the screw is accessible uh, in the front. Hmm, someone messed around here, but it is probably original. Who knows? This is a shielded can. And as always, it is brass with an Silver coating. Awesome. Siemens Sikotrop capacitors again. Beautiful. So, that's it. I hope you liked and enjoyed this video. I would be happy if you could put the thumbs up. Please subscribe if you haven't done already. And as you might know, I can really need help on Patreon. Uh, I'm not begging for your money, but uh, if you want to help my channel, this would really help. I can purchase more things for a tear down or I have more time to do videos. So you will benefit from any donation. So yeah, have a nice day. Bye. Mains power switch is in on position. 
Variac is at zero and we will raise the voltage. Let's see. I'll give the capacitors inside here some time to reform, reformate 80 volts, 90, 100. Yes, the tubes are slightly glowing. One hundred and sixty volts. I expect the unit to start working soon. One hundred and seventy volts. We have no frequency output yet. One hundred and eighty volts. We see the power lamp glowing. I hear some sort of high frequency noise. Let me check the fuses. 200 volts, 210, 220, finally. There's still nothing going on. That's sad. Oh, wait. Wait. Look at that. We have a 10 kilohertz cycle on a 10 kilohertz output. Isn't it beautiful? Woo! That's neat. What else can we get? One kilohertz. Nice. Woohoo! 100 hertz. Yes, beautiful. And 50 hertz. This is wobbling around. We have no pulse on the second contact. Or is it true? This is one second here. Look. No, is it too fast? The clock is ticking. It's ticking. It's alive. <laughs> That's great. Unbelievable. Woohoo. I would be very happy to see you again soon. Bye.